one. Here's Reed with a punt. He's going to kick this one. It's going to go all the way in the end zone. Nice punt by Chase Reed. He kicked that one out. So, Alamo scrimmage from their 20-yard line. 11.53 to go in this game. It's 21-17 Longview. Longview with a completely dominated the third quarter. Three unanswered touchdowns. Man, that was kind of an amazing third quarter, especially when you consider they hadn't done anything in the first half at all. And they had had one, two, three, four, five straight possessions in the first half where they didn't get a first down. Here's Allen. Matt Brown's going to run it up the field. He got a couple of yards, maybe three. It's going to be second down and seven. Stop on the play by Bubba Vactor. A long view along with Jeremiah Farley. Darren Brown also in on the tackle. Second down for Allen. They need six. The line of scrimmage is at 24. Here's Brown to throw it. Here's some pressure. This was a post over the middle. It's caught. It's oh, caught man. near midfield. And a first down out to the Longview uh, 49. Caught, caught there by the uh, wide receiver, Alex Pastor. Yeah, that's a nice throw and a nice catch. Alante Darden got there, but just just a hair too slow. It's a good throw, though, Brent. It's it sure a little seam route, and they got it to him in a hurry. And that's what you got to do. Had he waited to throw the ball, Darden, uh, Darden would have been able to uh, get there and break it up. First down and 10, Allen. Here's the throw by Brown. It's thrown on the out route, and a nice open field tackle by Darden. As a gain on the play of about three yards. It's going to be second, or no more than that. It's going to be second down and four. Six yard gain. 24 to uh, 21 to 17. Longview lead, leads the game in the fourth quarter with 10 minutes and 49 seconds to go. There's the gear right above a factor at the line of scrimmage. Well, and then, well, then they let him get away and got some yards. Bubba did everything except wrap up, and that's uh, as a consequence they break the tackle and end up with a first down. Let's see that. Devin, Devin, Marshall. Devin Marshall. Devin Marshall gets his first carry. That'll be a first down. Well, they're going to me- bring the change out to measure. Uh, I think that is a first, though. Going to stretch him tight. It's a first down. At the Longview 38-yard line. First down for Allen at the 38-yard line, 21-17. Longview leads in the game with 10.37 to go. First down and 10 for Allen at Longview's 37-yard line. Here's Brown to throw. It is almost intercepted by Joe Brown. Yeah, that's another miscommunication between the quarterback and receivers. He had triple trip receivers to this side. The inside guy ran an up route. The, the outside guy was down the field and he threw a little short route out there where nobody was. So right. somebody had, had the wrong uh, route. Second down and 10 for Allen at the Longview 38. There's the option play. Down the line comes Brown. Tackle. Couple of yards gain. It's going to be third down and eight or seven. Bubba Vactor made the tackle for Longview. It's a two-yard gain. It's going to be third down and seven. Yeah, I don't know about that play. Dominique either, Thomas. You run speed option to the short side of the field. Doesn't leave you a lot of running room. A lot of, a lot of uh, area to make a pitch either. Third down and seven for Allen for Longview 35. Two wide receivers near side, two to the far side of the field. Here's Brown back to throw it. Looks up. Now going to run out of the pocket. Now deep down the middle, incomplete. He had a receiver. Eddie McGee got there, but it was too tall and incomplete. It's going to bring up fourth down. Let's see if Allen will go for it or punt it away. Maybe too close to punt. I think they'll come back out in that short punt formation. Maybe they're going to take a timeout. Yeah, yeah, 
I guess. Oh, Longy's got an injured player. Yeah, that's that's it. Right. I think, think Longy's got an injured player, Tristan Coleman. Well, we've got an injured player. He's going to hell. He's going to get off the field. I think. No, I think he. <laughs> what happened? I tell you what happened. Some way his elbow got stuck in the offensive tackles. Face man. That's <laughs> what it looked like. <laughs> <laughs> Stuck up. <laughs> Had to come put his elbow out of the face mask. Yeah, that's exactly what it was. Fourth down and seven with 940 to go here in the football game. Allen football, Longview's 36-yard line. Snap it to Brown to the near side he rolled. And he's going to throw it. He's got a receiver. Oh, Incomplete. Uh, Incomplete. And Longview takes it over. That's a drop, Brent. Good grief. That's a big drop for them. Longview so, takes it over. It's a, it was a drop job. Ran uh, the out route to Andrew Rodriguez. And he was open. The ball right in his hands. And he just popped it up. And Longview gets the football back. And 36 to go in this game. Longview's got a four-point lead. And McCray's back in the game at I back. I keep emphasizing that because not to take away from the others, but our offense flows somewhat better when he's there. Well, he, you know, he did have 1,700 yards last year as a junior. <laughs> that might be why it flows better. Yes. He is the eye back on first down. Long count by Johnson. And they give it to McCray. McCray can't find anything. Tackle for a yard loss. It's going to be second down and 11. That time, Allen made penetration, and the stop was made initially on the play by Matt Chenault, the defensive end. So it's going to be second and 11 for Longview. Gray's coming off. It's second down and 11. Longview from the spread. Keelan Shaw's the running back on second and 11. Swing to the far side of the field. Aaron Johnson, play action pass. Looks up the field. Mm -hmm. Now he's in trouble. Now he finds a receiver. Did he catch it? Yes, he did. And Kerry Fortune. Kerry Fortune at the 44-yard line. It's going to be a little short of a first down, but what a tremendous catch by Fortson, John. That's his fifth of the night. He's caught five of the eight passes uh, caught for Longview, and that was a great catch. Third down, and Longview needs about a <coughs> yard and a half. At their own 44 with 8.16 to go in this game. This is a pretty big play right here. Raise the eye back. Third and about a yard and a half. Third down, and now Lombie's going to take a timeout. Lombie's going to call time. Lombie is going to take a timeout to talk this one over. It's third down and a long. I said one and a half. It may be closer to two. It's a pretty big play, John. Well, I'm telling you, we got 7.55 to play, but if Longview can pick a first down up here, Brent, then they can uh, probably run off a couple more minutes on the clock, even if they just uh, are stopping the next possession. So here's the, this will be a time eater if they can pick the first down up. It sure will be. Third down, it's going to be third and two. Longview's called time. We'll just stay right here with it. 